G'day ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to another let's play let's go let's see let's do and today what the hell are we going to do? Star Citizen folks and yes welcome back and today we're going to do a what was that first level hauling mission not the starter mission but the first level one but I'm going to do a double header. So once again I'm back at the BP service station and I'm actually going to, at least this is the plan for this one, I'm going to actually pick up a cargo, which I have already selected where I'm going to go to, which is Arc L2, drop it off, hopefully find something in Arc L2 to pick up and bring it back. Okay, simple enough. Let's see what today turns out, folks. So again, to help me out here, I'm going, I'm doing some really slow maneuvers and again, this is in the BP service station hangar, not my personal hangar. So we'll see what this means. And it means I fucking kiss the deck with my nose. Ev, you're a fucking idiot. How am I blocking an active flight bay? It's the one I selected. Um, so anyway, I have to take the elevator back down again. As in the freight manager elevator. It would be nice if it was there waiting for you. But then again, yeah, fair enough. Move it to the elevator. Send it back up. So what am I carrying this time? 80 SCU of aluminium ore to the Arc L2 Lively Pathway Station. Lovely. Oh, thank God for that. It's not all in singles. Um, let's get the beast. I think from here works. Let's pull him up. And scroll, 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 scroll. RSI, scroll, 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 scroll. Yay, and it's coming slowly. I must admit, I these missions are very, I would say, relaxing. But also too, maybe a bit too relaxing, if you understand. I mean, all you do is you fly your ship to somewhere, go in, scroll, 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 load up, fuck off, go to somewhere else, scroll, scroll, scroll. Maybe they get harder later on. Who knows? I don't, but we'll we'll find out. And so, yeah, this is the last one, which I'm just going to dump right about, yeah, there. So we've got, so two sets, we, yeah, we've got everything on board. So we'll just holster the weapon and head upstairs. We'll close the front of the ship. So here we go. Two, four, six, eight, ten. Yep, we've got everything. Okay, so off we go. This time, folks, instead of backing out, I'm going to spin the ship and try to go out of the hangar nose first. I've never spun the ship <laughs> around in this hangar, so I don't know if this is gonna work or if this is gonna be stupid. Probably a little of both. Or why am I going down? Nope, well, no, 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 stop. Why is it leaning to one side? All right, here we go. Yeah, we line him up. Doors look like they're opening or they've opened. Landing gear up, and ladies and gentlemen, are we going to push it? No, we're not going to push it just yet because that would be stupid. What we're going to do is set our markers. Yep, that's where we're going. Uh, that's where we're going. So we'll set that shit up now. Far more easier than where it was in the past. Okay, Ev, what mode are we going into? We're going into nav mode, which means do I push it out of here like a fucking idiot? Let's see. Oh, let's go for it. Let's rock and roll. Yeah, clear the fucking doors. Here we go, folks. We're at Lively Pathway Station at Arc L2. And for whatever fucking reason, the doors seem to be closing. What the hell's going on here? Ah, Star Citizen, it was going so well. It was a quick hop, step and a jump to get me here. Um, let's click on that. Did that fucking do anything? Outside of the doors closing? Ah! Uh, what is going on with this game? Um, press it again. You see a marker anywhere? Ah, uh, hang on. There's a marker, and the doors are opening again. Unfucking believable. All right, so we're going to creep up. I've got the landing gear down. 
So we're not going to go too fast. And I'm very impatient to get this shit in there. I wonder if one of those next missions, like at the higher thing, is like moving Quantitanium around or stuff like that. And I also wonder how many people will not do the mission and try to sell it. I would. Um, so, <laughs> let's have a look. So again, how are we for space? Uh, it looks like the hangar looks exactly like the BP service station. All right. So what we're going to do is the tried and true method thus far. Spinning the ship around ever so slightly, cautiously. And putting him down a little bit, but not too far down. I want to see how far across I can get. Okay, so I think this kind of looks all right. I, I can live with this, as long as I don't crash into fucking anything. So a little bit of a tapping of the controls, left, right, and center, and not a bad landing. So, folks, here we go. I'm not going to bore you with putting the first one in and putting the rest on. You you know how this shit works by now. I am going to put the last one over. It's going. It's scrolling. Frames there. Beautiful. So they're all there and delivered. And now I'm going to close the front. Of, oh, no, I'm not going to close the ship because I need to get back into it. I'm going to go to this terminal here. And I'm going to drop it down. Yep. Okay, it's moving shit down. It's making the noises. Yay, transfer complete. Now, do I get a message? Aha! Contract, rookie rank, delivered, done. So let's have a look at the, no, not at the wallet, Ev, 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 rep, thank you. And it's a Kovalax, where I'm fucking blind, there it is, aha, okay, so, not bad. That's going to probably take a bit of time. Let's have a look, that was my history, not the ones that I want. So, hauling. Oh, there's a lot more missions there now. Okay, now, I'm at Arc L2, so I need to find starting at Arc L2, not deliver to Arc L2, because then I'll start fucking crying. Okay, um, what was that? Okay, that's one. That's for 12K. Yeah, fair enough. Do we accept it? Because it's going to take us back to the BP service station. Yeah, fuck it. Oh, 12,500. Huh. Interesting, didn't see that. So, here we go. Let's pick him up. Move it over, lift him up. So this is not a bad way, really, if you're starting out. Well, I don't want to say starting out. That's pretty. Uh, that's probably a bad thing. Oh, shit, they're little boxes, aren't they? But there's not a lot of them. There's, what was it, six or eight? No, six. All right. So let's line him up, pick him up. It's going to do that fucking stupid thing again when I move it, isn't it? Ah, here we go. I don't like that view, and of course, when I try to change it, it just drops it. This is what I want. So again, we'll move it over, load him in there, and I lost my train of thought. Actually, no, here we go. So folks, again, if you have a cargo ship and you want to make money outside of going off to all those different landing pads and like getting the cargo from there, like a Laranite, Diamond, Gold, if that's still a valuable commodity, I'm leaving out all the illegal shit, but you know what I'm saying. I think this has a bit of an interesting way forward. I mean, it used to, let's say, the load time is what kills it. But it is interesting now because the load time kind of plays in with the, um, the time where you would actually be waiting for the stupid shit to come back into well, that have been mined and processed and everything. So in other words, ready for quakes. So a good example is when we're waiting for Laranite, you know, how you usually just sit there, run around the whole area at maybe, what is it, um, Arquot Mining Area 56 or something, and you're sitting there for like 15 minutes going, fuck, what am I going to do? Twiddle my fingers and play with my dick. That's all I can do, really, just wait. Now, instead of waiting, you can load your ship up. How cool is that? Anyway, you know where I'm going with that. Different gameplay, different modes, different way of going about it. Good and bad sides for everything. Anyway, we're at Arcorp, and this time I'm not going to actually land the ship sideways, okay? I'm going to put it down how I would normally put it down, and that's because I'm going to log off after this, because I've had enough. I mean, you guys have probably seen this in what? 
10, 12 minutes in total, maybe, it's taken me about 45, including quantum travels and all that other shit. So let's not worry about that. Let's grab the last container. Oh, fuck. What happened there? So we'll put this here. And again, with this big ass tractor beam, you can do this. With the handheld pyro tool or the multi-tool thing, can't do this shit anymore, which is a bit annoying. All right, that's there. Let's holster him. So that's everything. Yep, so jump down. What? Jumping down, I got bloody 1% health reduction. I'll piss off. Anyway, I won't bitch about that one now. But um, yeah, okay, that wasn't that high either. So let's go here. And if this all goes well, confirm that's six of six. What time remaining? 18 minutes and something. Was that one timed, was it? Huh. interesting should read more often um so yeah that one's gonna go down thing complete let's move out the way is this gonna be my message yep that's done fantastic and i'm gonna drop the ship well store the ship let's say like that so you're going down whoa did they increase the speed of that thing going down did they huh kind of went down a lot quicker than the last time I remember doing this shit. And the um, things are already closing, are they? Yeah, but fuck it. We don't care about that. So let's head off to... Ah. Uh, oh God, can I get rid of that noise? That's annoying. So we'll get off because I want to see here. Uh, it doesn't even show me what bloody... Am I... Okay, there's another bug there. It doesn't show me where I am. Apparently I'm somewhere, but nowhere. And this is very strange, folks. Walking past here without putting your ship away. Anyway, thanks for watching.